Hello and welcome all signs. This is going to be a reading over your next tw 24 hours. Uh, whatever comes up, we will talk about. Keep in mind that it is a 24 hour reading, so the energies are not that big. And it's going to be a quick message for you. Uh, make sure to follow and subscribe to know when I come up with a new reading. And thank you all for being here. It means a lot. So, let's begin. Aries, so this is going to be your next 24 hours, whatever comes up, we will talk about. So let's see what you need to know in the next 24. A quick message. So, Aries, in the next 24 hours, kind of just do see you uh, focusing on you and yourself. Maybe you're doing some physical activities, which will lead you to be quite exhausted by the end of the day. But maybe you're just making uh, cleaning your uh, your place moving around some furniture just uh, spending time <clears throat> I kind of do see you feeling very comfortable, Aries, in the next 24, um, doing things that you would like to do to improve yourself. This can just be, or improve your uh, your house as well, or your place. Some cleaning, some just, some workout. I kind of do see you, um, doing something that requires your like uh, lifting things or like going for a walk um, yeah. it's like you taking care of all the small things that needs to be taken care of uh, and with a cross being here, it's like, uh, well, the things that are not that fun to do, but you know that you have to do it. Uh, so, Aries, that was just a quick message for you for the next 24. Kind of do see you cleaning or working out, like something that you you would rather just relax but you know you have to take care of it so that's what i have for you aries thank you and bye taurus so it's going to be your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about so let's see what you need to know for the next 24 what's going on what's gonna happen
There we go. So, Doris, this can be you making some plans to go visit someone to, uh, well, to have some passion. It can be a passionate getaway as well that you are planning. Uh, or someone is coming towards you, Taurus, to have this... Uh, Passion, but you can. I'm gonna clarify. Yeah, so Taurus, in the next 24 hours, I kind of do see you um, longing or planning to, well, it's like you are longing to have some peace, Taurus. Uh, but at the same time, it's like you're planning to say something to someone. Um, something you've been thinking about and it's like how can I tell them uh, without them taking it the wrong way there's something that you that needs to be said here yeah Can also mean to us that you've been uh, having some rough times going through, and you're just planning a getaway. You know, trying to figure out where to go to restore your balance. Uh, it can be that as well, or you, or the person, your person. It's like, yeah, we need to get away or like we need to uh, a weekend just for us somewhere anywhere can be that as well Taurus are you making some plans to uh, travel to find this peace and balance again so that's what I have for you Taurus thank you and bye Cancer, so oh, this is going to be your next 24 hours, whatever comes up, we will talk about. So let's see what you need to know for the next 24, what's going to happen? Kind of do see you, Cancer, receiving some sort of communication um, that you weren't expecting. So it can be uh, from a person from the past, uh, like an old friend or like someone you haven't heard for from in a in a while. I will 
just Yeah, there is some sort of communication here cancer that you will receive in the next 24 hours where well it will just make you happy and it is someone from the past uh, it can even be you cancer that reaching out to an old friend uh, Like maybe you will start to think about them and then you will just reach out and it can be the other way around as well that someone will reach out to you um, can be with a knight of cups and the tower that it is uh, someone uh, like an ex as well But some sort of communication uh, coming your way, Cancer, which uh, well, you do have the sun here, it will make you happy. So it's a happy communication. So that's what I have for you, Cancer. Thank you and bye. Cancer! So this is going to be your next 24 hours. Whatever comes up, we will talk about. So let's see what you need to know for the next 24. What's gonna happen? Kind of do see you, Cancer, receiving some sort of communication um, that you weren't expecting. So it can be uh, from a person from the past, uh, like an old friend or like someone you haven't heard for from in a in a while. I will just <laughs> yeah, but it's some sort of communication here cancer that you will receive in the next 24 hours where well it will just make you happy and it is someone from the past uh, it can even be you cancer that reaching out to an old friend uh, Like maybe you will start to think about them and then you will just reach out and it can be the other way around as well that someone will reach out to you um, can be with a knight of cups and the tower that it is uh, someone uh, like an ex as well But some sort of communication 
uh, coming your way cancer which uh, well, you do have the sun here it will make you happy so it's a happy communication so that's what I have for you cancer thank you and bye Leo so it's going to be your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about let's see what's going on what's gonna happen for you Leo. In the next 24 So, Leo, in the next 24 hours, I kind of do see you um, stressing out or uh, carrying some sort of burden regarding uh, love. I will clarify. about that um, so Leo it's like you're putting yourself into this uh, emotion because you are feeling good but at the same time uh, a bit confused on where to or who to date or it's like you're starting to wonder where you should put your energy it's like you're looking around and not finding anyone suitable or nothing that you're interesting in interested in it's like you're starting to put this worry upon yourself because uh, all the offers or everyone you know or look at is like not speaking to you Uh, you do you feel like they are not matching your energy leo uh, the people surrounding you that causes a little bit of a worry but you do have the sun over the cross in a 24 hour reading so it's like uh, well up and down Yeah. So, Leo, that's what I had for you for your next 24. A little bit of looking around and not finding anything that it's speaking to you. It can be a person or just uh, like a new interest or hobby you want to try out. But, uh, yeah. So, a little bit of worries and wonder, confusion in the next. 24. Thank you and bye. Virgo. So, it's going to be a reading for the next 24 hours. Whatever comes up, we will talk about. Let's see what's going on. What's going to happen in the next 24 for you 
there we go. Whip. Maybe some passion, maybe some discussions. So, there we go, this can be you uh, well, teaching someone, maybe your children or just someone, um, some important lessons in the next 24, but we did have the Two of Cups flying out as well. It can be... Yes, you and your person or someone wanting to reconcile with you as well, but you're gonna tread carefully around them. Uh, let's see. So there we go in the next 24 i kind of do see because we do have the two of cups here uh and the knight of pentacles so it might be someone coming in with an, an apology uh, but i'm not seeing you accepting it or maybe you're accepting it but not nothing more than that This can even be you, Virgo, uh, feeling one moment that you want to reconcile with someone, but then you're gonna like, nah, I'm not gonna do it. Um, or maybe you are, cause, well. Um, I'm not sure Virgo if you are accepting or not because you do have a chance of a new beginning here but at the same time walking away but I guess the, you will know what to do But it can be as well, uh, Virgo, in the next 24 that you are trying something new with uh, your person, a new experience, but not liking it or like a one time only kind of thing. But now we tried it. Uh, and never again. So this can be a new experience that you're gonna do with your person or as well someone coming in for an apology uh, and that's it so there we go that's what I have for you thank you and bye Libra so it's going to be your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about so let's see what you need to know what's gonna happen in the next 24 
There we go. So Libra, I kind of do see you in the next 24 hours just spending time with a friend or friends and just having a good time talking about everything and nothing. Um, Yeah, it's like uh, something happened. It's like good gossip that you're having with your friends, Libra. Uh, some rumors going around. Like something major happened to one of them or someone you know, and you're just talking about it, having a good time. Um, With the Ace of Wands and the Clover. It's like a... It's like something good as well Libra like some something uh, something good that you didn't expect as well is gonna happen in the next 24 um, it's hard to t tell what it is because uh, it's only a 24 hour reading, so the energies are not that big, but it is an ace and a clover, so uh, well, something joyful at least is going to happen in the next 24, um, something that's going to pique your interest and your, your passion. Yeah, a happy moment, Libra. And spending time with friends and talking so Libra that's what I had for you uh, yeah thank you and bye Scorpio so it's going to be your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about so let's see what's gonna happen for you what you need to know in the next 24 there we go So Scorpio, can I do see you or someone that is, well, seeing you, like wanting to come up and speak to you? Um,
I'm gonna clarify Scorpio. <laughs> so I know um, I'm a little vague. Yeah, I kind of do see Scorpio in the next 24 hours being in your own um, bubble. And it's like someone is uh, noticing you. Like you don't notice them. Maybe you're out shopping or, or just eating at a restaurant or something and someone will find you quite beautiful and I do see it being someone new with the rider here um, but yeah it's like you do hit like when they see you it's like maybe they're coming in to talk to you but I'm I'm not sure but they do have someone seeing you at least uh, Yeah, it's like you're meeting someone new, uh, Scorpio, in the next 24, or at least someone is noticing you, because I kind of do see you being in your, uh, oops, like not, not seeing them. Can be because you are out with friends or family or, yeah. So, Scorpio, in the next 24, kind of do see you, well, having a good time as well, because you do have the uh, Four of Wands, or some sort of celebration, or just having a good time, and someone will, noticing, no, will notice you, uh, finding you quite beautiful and attractive so that's what I have for you Scorpio uh, keeps your eyes up and bye Sagittarius so it's going to be a reading for your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about Let's see what's going to happen for you. What do you need to know? In your next 24. Like you do have something that is uh, worrying you, Sagittarius. Um, it's like, yeah, it's almost like you do have to tell someone something that you will know will lead to an argument. Um, we'll clarify. Sagittarius, looks like you do have some bad news to tell someone in the next 24. Or this can just be you as well. 
like remembering something that like old feelings appearing in the next 24 um, We do have two tens here. So this is like the final, the final thoughts before you can move on completely or the final words or discussion or before you can move on completely and start a new cycle or a new chapter. So, Sagittarius, the next 24, uh, maybe you do have to tell someone something that will lead to an argument, or this is just you uh, remembering something painful, because we do, it's uh, some heavy cards here, uh, something pay painful that happened to you, it's like the last, it's like you're grieving for the last time, and then you're moving on to this new chapter as well um, so maybe some old memories bubbling up uh, Sagittarius making you wonder what if but it's a healing process as well so you can move on completely so that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. Thank you and bye. Capricorn. So this is going to be your next 24 hours. Whatever comes up, we will talk about. Let's see what's going on for you and what's going to happen in the next 24. So Capricorn, in the next 24 hours, I kind of do see you Well, I kind of do see you wanting to shake things up in your, can be in your relationship with your person like maybe you are, it's maybe it's too stable, like it's getting to that point where it's feeling a little bit boring uh, or this can just be you in your daily routine Capricorn it's like something is missing like you want to try something new or it's like you're feeling a bit bored can even be at, at work Capricorn yeah it's like you are um, not enjoying or at least in the next 24 but it can be more than that but you're not joy enjoying your daily routine when it comes to well work and all the things that you need to do daily it's like you're getting bored you're needing something like you're wanting something more Yeah, 
but this is a 24 hour reading so in the next 24 hours i kind of do see you bored with your daily routine uh, or what you just have to do in the next 24 maybe you are having to do some hard things and some boring work in the next yeah but it looks like you are wanting to do something more for you so capricorn that's what i had for you thank you and bye aquarius so this is going to be your next 24 hours whatever comes up we will talk about it. so let's see what you need to know what's gonna happen in the next 24 Quit message to Aquarius. It's almost like you're um, it's like you are playing head games with someone new Aquarius in the next 24 hours um, I'm gonna gonna need to clarify something about this can I do see you in the next 24 hours meeting someone new or uh, just a newer person in your life but there's something about them that you're not trusting um, so you are keeping your like really focused when you are speaking to them more it's like something something about them that you don't trust uh, can be that they are too self-involved Like believing they are this awesome person and that everybody wants them but not yeah so but not you Aquarius there's something about them uh, it's a newer person or maybe just in the next 24 hours you will meet someone uh, being all confident and well look at me kind of person A little bit of trying to trick and manipulate you, maybe Aquarius, but 
I don't see them succeeding. So that's what I have for you, Aquarius. Uh, thank you and bye. Pisces. So it's going to be your next 24 hours. Whatever comes up, we will talk about. Let's see what you need to know for the next 24 So, Pisces, in the next 24 hours, I kind of do see you um, Well, either you are like breaking uh, a gossip going around so maybe people are, are telling you something and you're just uh, correcting them and telling them it's not true This is you, Pisces. Mm, I'm gonna need to clarify. Can be that you're breaking or telling someone's secret or maybe your own. I do see you speaking up Pisces can be something surrounding work uh, someone is spreading rumors or telling someone else's secret and you are just speaking up and correcting them This can be you as well, Pisces, that you've been feeling some sort of way. That someone is making you feel uncomfortable or like not included. You're kind of speaking up in the next 24. Yeah, so Pisces, uh, I do see you speaking up. I don't know if it is to correct someone or if it is because something has been going on at work and well, you're not having it anymore. So that's what I have for you, Pisces. Thank you and bye.